Hi everybody, it's a sad day. My Nanikins died unexpectedly yesterday. Um, the vet said that it most, he's quite certain it was a stroke and that's certainly how she acted. And I'm very blessed that both of my dogs died in their own beds and with me by their side and relatively quickly. Nani was confused and disoriented and by the time we got to the vet she didn't even know who I was anymore or where she was but she didn't seem to be in any pain. I took a picture of her that morning that turns out to be one of my favorite all-time pictures of her and I didn't know it of course would be the last one I would take of her and she died six hours later she that morning she had a great yesterday morning this happened yesterday she had a great morning she uh, ate and it was cool and she was frisky and running around the, the the road is dirt and sand and she loves that and she was playing and uh same thing with my bentley on his last day he, he was happy that morning and so i'm very grateful for that too my friend robert drove us down the mountain in my van so I could stay in the back and keep her comforted and quiet and calm and I found a very compassionate vet in town and that link is in the description and I'm very grateful for them as well they gave me a complimentary paw um, paw print of Nani's and I have a laminated paw print of Bitley's that I will store in here along with my baby girl's paw print. And this is a little stuffed animal that I got of Bit that I got to remind me of Bitley when he died. And it they just they have been my my rock for so long. You know, Nani was my faithful, devoted companion for ten and a half years, and Bitley for almost fifteen. And I lost him in March, and so it, it's weird to, to be without them. They, I would wake up some days, and I might be disoriented and, and because of my brain injury and, and not know what day it was, where I was, and be able to really function. But I could look at my dogs, and I knew I was going to be okay. So I have this little stuffed animal, and then next month when I get my check, I'm going to get a Rhodesian Ridgeback pillow <laughs> because Nani's favorite place was snuggling in the bed with me and Bentley's was riding and looking out the windshield so he'll go on the dashboard and next month I'll get a Rhodesian Ridgeback pillow for my bed. And Robert went to town today and I have other friends that are that will be here this afternoon. But for today, for the first time ever in my two years out here, I am alone w without my dogs, uh, without anybody around. And for a little bit, just for a little bit there, let me sit Bentley down, I felt scared. I, got, I had a, like a panic attack and that's not what this life is about and, and I won't allow myself to stay there. I'll uh, get a grip and get this video tribute done for my Nonikins because she deserves all the love in the world sent to her in her heavenly world now. And I want you guys to see what a beautiful animal she was and what she meant to me over the years.
Nani, you gotta wait your turn. No, you gotta wait your turn. Good girl, good wait. Okay, Nani's turn. Let's go, Nani. You, you don't want to take a bath? It's your turn. Oh, I thought you might. That is such a good girl. I'll see you down the road.